Alright, so now I'm finally doing the ring gap. We're gapping the the bottom ring to or the top ring I mean to 0, 2, 3. And we're gapping the bottom one to 0, 2, 6. Alright, the secondary ring has been gapped to 0 0.026 and yep, they're all gapped now the next thing I need to test is my cylinder to wall clearance because I think it's a little tight in some spots probably should have measured that first before I did my ring gaps but we're here now or I could just send it but you know Yeah, I, I just talked to my machine shop guy. I think I'm just going to get the block decked just to be safe because I couldn't get, like, you can just barely feel those little, those marks from the old composite head and gasket. I got it pretty, pretty smooth with a plastic razor blade, but if I'm going to send the block and pistons to get the clearance checked, then I might as well get it decked, right? So, this is it for this video, I'm probably going to edit this up and post it and then it'll be another few weeks before I get the block back and then put the crank back in, put the pistons and rods in, plastic gauge the rod bearings, make sure those are all good, and then, yep kind of a shame because if I knew I was going to have to get the cylinder wall slightly bored to ma match the pistons then I wouldn't even need a new block so shame on me but yep till next time see ya